So meet me on that island Kiss me on that show Hey, promise me that we'll sail away And I'll be yours forevermore Just promise me that we'll sail away And I'll be yours forevermore Alright, to say today we have decided to uh, make a short hop down to Farmer's Key, which is about an hour and a half sail, just to kind of knock off some time of the big sail down to Georgetown, which we're going to do tomorrow morning. Uh, we're trying to get down there before tomorrow late. So we decided why not uh, have a nice sail today. It's really pretty out today, good wind, and uh, knock a chunk of it off. So. That's where we're headed right now. Are you ready when you are? Pretty sweet conditions today, about 10 knots right on the beam, and uh, shouldn't change too much. I think it's supposed to go up to maybe about 13 or 14. Can't ask for much more than that. Flat seas. This is what we wait for. I see you fish. Good technique. <laughs> We're gonna start putting real hooks on there pretty soon, bud. So our course here is a little bit complex because um, there's a bank that runs all down along Great Guana and you can't really get across it with our draft. So this all here, this is like the shallow bank part. And there's no place down in here really to get across too well. But up through here, it's all eight, nine, ten, even more. So we're gonna sneak in, gotta go through a couple core heads here, and then we'll be in a nice line of 11, 12, 9, 8, all the way down to here. And right in there is the anchorage we're going for at Little Farmer's Key. But otherwise, there's no place to get in. That's our plan, so we're kinda going upwind a little bit right now to get ourselves up and inside that sandbar and we should be cool.
adventure mission. Ah! Ah! We're going to go see a cave. Or stand. He claims to go and stand. Zeke, wait. Wait, wait, wait. We'll have a long swim. He's ready. He's ready. Don't get wet. Don't get wet. Don't get wet. Zeke is so ready. He's going. Don't hit him. Wow, that's a good jump. Find a cave yet? No, it's that way. So we are anchored off. What key is this? That's Oven Rock, yeah. Great. We were we were headed toward Farmer's Keys, which are down there, but the anchoring did not look very enticing. We poked our nose around on the uh, western side of Little Farmers, and it was just shallow and rocky, and nobody over there, and we had already passed these three catamarans sitting in this nice spot right off the beach and we decided it looked like a spot we'd like to go back to so here we are dog happy dog happy child happy wife nailing it
before the sun, kind of. Well, yeah. 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 We are. <laughs> Going to Georgetown. It's early. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Come on. Today we are headed to Georgetown. Uh, we're sitting here. I forget what the name of this key is. It's still the same one. It, well, yeah, it's still Great Guana Key, I guess. No matter. We're down here by the uh, Farmer's Key Cut. And uh, getting ready to head out into Exuma Sound, uh, which now we kind of call the outside. It's not the Atlantic, but it's closer. <laughs> but we think it should be about an eight hour sail, somewhere around there. Should be pretty nice today. Less than a meter C, and um, about 14 knots of wind all day. So, should be a good sail, get down there by 3 o'clock, get tucked in before tonight's blow. It's going to be blowing 25 to 30 knots uh, late this evening and all through the night, and I think all through the day tomorrow too. Yeah, we'll see you on the water. And we're off. <laughs> we got 50 miles to go, should take us about 8 hours uh, if we go 6 knots, so that should be pretty... Doable. Just wavy, real wavy. So it's been a 
exciting, but we're hauling ass, even with our sort of handicapped sail plan here. We had a little trouble uh, unfurling our main. We just didn't want to force it, and frankly, we've been doing better than seven knots with it like it is. So we'll wait until we get into anchor and get a light wind today and we'll gently get it out of there. I think what happened was we decided to try to furl it while we were still going downwind and very light wind. When you furl it into the wind it sort of helps uh, roll it up a little snugger and I think maybe that's what happened. It kind of got rolled up a little loosely in there and so up there at about middle to two-thirds it's just kind of binding up. So we won't do that anymore. Live and learn. Other than that, can't really complain. It's you know, we're sailing plenty fast, and uh, it's a beautiful day. It's just real wavy, much more than they predicted. They got the wind right. <laughs> yeah, we don't know what it is yet. See it flash around it's way back there. We weren't paying attention, and it uh, took a good bit of our line out. I see it. That's a mahi mahi, all right, isn't it? Yeah. It's a dolphin. It's a, it's it's, a fish. It's dolphin. a mahi mahi. Our uh, our mahi got away earlier, so uh. now we we put out the hand line too. Beautiful sunset. All, all the conks are coming out, rocking out with their conks out. We all made it here in one piece. We've uh, all had a couple drinks and we are ready to basically go to bed, but we do have to eat first. <laughs> yeah. We have to decide if we're going to cook some of those fish or take the I think easy we way should, out. I think we should take the easy way out tonight and do fish maybe tomorrow and like prepare. What is the easy way out? Mac and cheese? Um, yeah, probably some mac and cheese or something. I can't do that. We caught two big, beautiful mahis, and we're probably going to eat canned tuna tonight. I'm not judging, I just think it's I can, it's funny. I can make spaghetti with turkey if it makes you feel better. Eh, whatever. I'm just happy that we're here. We can do, we haven't done spaghetti in a long time. We made Maybe it to Georgetown. Just... Later on. Drifted away on an ocean. Thanks so much for watching. Please like and subscribe and ring that bell. And a huge thanks to all our patrons for their additional support. If you'd like to become a member of our crew, just check out our Patreon link in the description. Cheers! Didn't have you to hold me as the sun sets and miles roll by.